Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Prem and Proper YouTube channel. So we have some exciting stuff going on in our home today. We are having our living room renovated. We're changing from a carpeted floor to a hardwood floor, and I'm pretty excited about this. So as you all know, we have been spending all of our time at home due to the pandemic. And because of this, our carpet has really gone through a lot of wear and tear. We have a lot of accidents with spills since the kids are home all the time. And so we decided that we are changing our carpeted floor to a hardwood floor. So we have been living in this house for over five years. And one of the most exciting things about living in a home that was built from scratch is that you get to be part of the building process and the details and what goes where and what's placed where to some extent. So we got to really personalize our home into how we wanted it. And one of the personalizations that we did was add a carpet to our family room. We really were sure that we wanted our, our living room to have carpet, all the bedrooms to have carpet as well as the hallways. But, and we were doing fine, but because we're home so much and because the kids are always rolling and doing stuff on the carpet, we've noticed that the carpet has just been worn out very quickly in the past 10 months. Not to forget all the stains from spills that this carpet has gone through. And then we also noticed that the edges really started to like rip up and tear out as you can see here. So we were actually planning about two weeks ago to bring someone in and really like deep clean our carpet. But then a light bulb switched in my head and I was like, why don't we just change this carpet to hardwood floor and be done with all of this? We decided we were going to change the carpet into a hardwood floor that will match our living room, um, our dining room area and our kitchen. So today the guys are here to do that for us um, and I am pretty excited. So they started by of course ripping off the carpet and you should have seen how sad the kids were they have been against this whole project that we decided to do because they love having the carpet they can lay on the carpet you know they roll they do tumbling and gymnastics and whatnot but which is fine but i just could not deal with having spills and you know food and drinks and the, on the carpet anymore so today we're getting that done and it was pretty exciting so we we did some research about what company to use we actually had no idea how much this renovation was going to cost us you know we threw out some numbers from 1k to 1.5k but boy, were we off because this project ended up costing us a little over 3K. Um, and although we hadn't really planned to do that this year, I think it was worth it. Um, and we will really see the benefits of doing this later on. So the carpets have started to go out. There is Nanama. Um, and as you can see, the guys had their mask on the whole time they worked in our home. We didn't have our mask on, but Nanama felt like she needed to have her mask on. Um, but I, I think we were fine. So they are taking out the carpet and you will see how shocked the kids were when they noticed that this whole house, like the floor is complete wood. They were like, wait, what? That's what it looks like. Yep, that's a, a home, I mean, a house in America for you. So go ahead, keep watching so you can see 
the transformation and what a great job the guys did. They had estimated that it would take about four hours to complete the job and it was right on. It took about that long to finish everything. So actually a few days before they came to do the job, they delivered the hardwood to our home um, because they said that the wood needed to adjust to the temperature in our home before they could use it. So um, we had the wood in our home for a few days, I think three or four days um, before they came to do their job. So they're getting ready to start placing the wood on the floor. They start with the edges and the corners. And what I noticed was that the edges and the corners take the longest. They probably spend over an hour just measuring and doing the corners and making sure things aligned. But once they were done with the corners, everything moved pretty quickly. So like I was saying, I went upstairs for, I think, 10 to 15 minutes. And by the time I got back, they had literally done about half of the room. So it moves quick, very quickly once you're done with the edges and once you're done with the corners. And did you guys hear my little niece, Ikea, screaming in the background? She is literally the boss in the house right now. No one can tell her nothing. She is the boss, even over Sadie. <laughs> So they've just moved to the other end and are just filling in the empty spaces and that also moved very quickly. And I can't believe my family room is literally being transformed and I love it. It already looks so much brighter in here and I love it, but keep watching so you can see what it looks like at the end. all done and I absolutely love it. It looks so great. I think it will be very easy for us to maintain as opposed to the carpet that we had 
And it also looks so much bigger in here and I love it. It looks perfect. I'm so glad we did this and I'm so glad that we got to share this with you. So thanks so much for watching this video. Let me know what you think of this decision we made. Did we make the right decision? Leave us some comments. If this is your first time on our channel, please subscribe to our channel. If you've already been watching and you haven't subscribed, please do and see you again. Bye.